As the provincial capital, Chengdu is a major city in western China. It has a history of over 2,000 years and due to the fertile Chengdu plain where Chengdu is situated, it is often known as the country of heaven or the land of abundance. Chengdu is the fifth most populous city in China, with over 10 million inhabitants, but most of its fame comes from being home to the cute giant pandas. Ready for a three-day adventure in Chengdu? Here is where you should go. Start off your Chengdu tour with an adventure with pandas, a must-have experience on any traveler's bucket list. Head to the suburb of Chengdu where the giant panda breeding and research center is located. It's interesting to note that all the pandas in the world are loaned out by China, all under the agreement that all newborns are returned back to the homeland to help spread the gene pool. At the giant panda breeding and research center, take an exciting trip inside and say hello to the cute giant pandas and learn about their living habits, their environment, and what kind of initiatives China has done to help save the giant pandas. After, return to Chengdu where you can enjoy a leisurely stroll through the broad and narrow alleys where you can discover the city's past. Enjoy some tea at the local tea house and witness the local people's laid-back lifestyle. They spend a lot of time drinking tea and playing mahjong, and if you don't already know how to play, you can get a chance to learn and play mahjong with the locals. Start off your second day by heading from Chengdu to Lisan, which is about a two-hour drive away from the city. Lisan is famous for being home to a large Buddha sculpture carved from a cliff, also known as Lisan Giant Buddha. Built in the Tang Dynasty, the Buddha statue is 71 meters high. It's a stunning work of art. The size alone is surreal. After appreciating the Lishan Giant Buddha, you can visit the Buddhist temple nearby. After, head to Mount Imei in Limei Shan City. Mount Imei is one of the four great Buddhist mountains in China. The other three are Mount Wutai, Mount Puto, and Mount Jinghua. Mount Yimei has around 76 Buddhist temples and most of them are on the top of the mountain. You can take a shuttle bus from the foot to the middle of the mountain and then take a cable car up to the top of the mountain to the Golden Summit. On your last day, enjoy the sunrise and the sea of clouds from the Golden Summit. From here you can visit the huge foresight statue, the Huazhen Temple, and the Copper Palace, all phenomenal landmarks popular with tourists. After exploring the Golden Summit, descend from the cable car and take a shuttle bus and head over to visit the Baoguo Temple and Fuhua Temple at the foot of the mountain. Want to take this 3-day tour to Chengdu? Click the link on the screen or in the description box below and don't forget to subscribe for more great videos about China.